Hi, in today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to make a website secure on GoDaddy. So before we start, of course, the first thing that you would like to do is just go and open whatever browser you are going to use to follow this tutorial steps with. Here in my case, I'm actually using Brave, but of course in your case, you can use any other browser could be possibly working for you. Once you open that browser, make sure to go into this URL section, simply type godaddy.com and hit the enter button. Of course, that should take you into this page. And if you're facing any issues with the language, as I faced in my first time in this website, you'll have to scroll down until the bottom of it and make sure to change the country or region, which will take the or which will change the language with it. Of course, if you want even to change the currency, that will be possible. So now I uh, will have to go back and log in into your account if you have one. And if you don't have an account, you'll have to go and create one. Of course, you will be able to do both options as this top right corner option, you will find the option to create or even log in into your account. Once you did one of those two options, you'll find yourself on this screen, which is going to be your home screen or your main screen on the Get on GoDaddy website. So as we said in the beginning of this tutorial, we would like to make our website secure. So once you, if you want to do that, of course, you'll have to get to the products page first. Uh, click at your name at the top right corner, then click at my products, which will take you to the, pro to the products page. Once you're here, scroll down until you find this domain sections. If it's not expanded, expand it. And as you can see here for this website or uh, for this domain name, as you can see, protection plan is not. And if I want to make my... Uh, uh, protection like plan is good and or I want to make my website secure I can simply click at up, updates or upgrade protection so once I click on that as you can see they're giving me two options if I want the full domain protection or the ultimate one of course everyone has its own benefits and its own price of course as you can see for the first uh, like time you're gonna pay those you're gonna pay it less but of course if you're gonna renew this is gonna renew for ten dollars kind of and this is gonna renew for thirty dollars so choose whatever suits you of course you can read here all the benefits that comes with and once you finish uh, choose whatever you want you can select checkout which will take you to the cards and you can buy it by entering your with this card numbers or paypal or whatever you're gonna buy with it so this is actually for this tutorial i hope you like it thank you guys for watching it goodbye